on viewers and subscribers i'm coming at you again with another tutorial one that i am very excited about now as you can see right here i have my taylor 214 ce acoustic electric guitar and i'm running it through my fender mustang one amp now as you guys know my acoustic tutorials are never straight strumming it always have a little bit of sugar a little bit of something here are some receipts Now that you have seen those, let me just say, this next tutorial is mainly for the intermediate people or for people that are moving from intermediate to advanced. So please, no comments like this one. But as a beginner, you want to challenge yourself, please go ahead. In fact, I highly recommend it. My Fender Mustang One Amp has a little bit of reverb, that's all. Why? Just for encouragement, you know, just to sweeten the music a little bit. Let me just take this time out to say, if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, please do so. Go ahead, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit all so whenever I post a new video, you will be the first to know. Without any further ado, let me show you how to play Bob Marley's Running Away. Grab your guitars. Let's go. Okay, let me just say this real quick. I cannot play and sing this song at the same time. I do not have that talent. Or probably I haven't been practicing enough. <laughs> but if you can, then kudos to you. Alright? Now, onwards. This song has only two cards. Right? Even though it, you hear changes, it's just the two cards that remain the same. Right? Now you're wondering why it sounds so good. What's making the change? Well, it's the bass line. Right? So if you're supposed to just play the song... Strum the song, you know, which is going to be monotonous and boring, just two cards, right? It's going to be something like You're running and you're running and you're running away You're running and you're running and you're running away You're running and you're running and you're... You know, it's, you don't want to just do that, right? So, I arranged this song, this one, for mainly for duos and trios or whatever Not just one person, but like I said, if you alone can do it, then perfect, alright? keep moving all right so but when you listen you're going to realize that i'm just moving two cards so it's those are just the two cards i'm using but the bass line is moving all over all right so um the cards it's g minor to c minor now i use minor sevens all right to allow the pinky finger to do some work all right so yeah so let's get these cards down first you want to buy the whole third fret and you want to place that ring finger on the fifth string fifth fret sorry so that's the card right there that's your G E minor keep buying the same fret and you want to place the middle finger on the second string fourth fret you want to place the ring finger on the fourth string fifth fret like that now it's from the fifth string all right so from here to here and those 
I'm trying to get my guitar not to feel back too much. All right. Um, so, yeah. So those are the only two cards. Now, see, now, the strumming, the thumb, that is what's going to take control on you. And the thumb and the pinky finger, this pinky finger and the thumb right here. So these two are going to work together. Okay? So, you just want to make sure that the fingers are, are that the arm, the, the frets are properly barred. And the way you set the finger, the hand, is like, it's like this. Alright? So the thumb goes down and these pick up. Thumb down, these pick. Thumb down, these pick. You know? So that's how it's basically working. Alright, so. Like that. Alright. So if I should play it. Just because the way I'm holding it, just I'm just showing you guys, you know. My bad. All right, so that's just to give you guys an idea of how I hold, you know, how I position this one right here. All right, so remember you want to keep that third fret barred at all times. So you want to go like this, and I'm gonna play it slow. I want you guys to follow, watch and follow. So it's like. See that? Again. So this is for the intro, you know. Here we go. So down, down, pull. Down. Then you move to the fifth string. Go back to the sixth string and pull and play the, the sixth string at the same time. Then play the thumb only again. So watch again. Down, down. Everything. Then thumb alone. Alright, so. Alright, so that's the first part. We're getting we're moving. See that? So now you move to the second card. I remember we're still on the intro. So you wanna pull. Now remember now the root is the fifth string. Alright? So it's not the thicker string now. You are, you're at a different card and that's just a C. So you're gonna play. Now you're gonna Play down with the thumb and you're gonna pull up on the cards at the same time. So and play with the thumb two times. And watch after that two times with the thumb down, then the pinky finger comes in to the fifth um, the fifth string, fifth fret. So watch again everything together. Pinky finger down. Then just that, just a thumb. So again, so again, so here we go again. Sometimes it's going to be. So pay attention to that. All right. So I hope I'll, it is important that you guys listen to this song. Listen to the song. 
all right that's the only way you're gonna really get it if you listen to the song so here we go again we're still on the intro my bad That's it for the intro. All right. Now, when it gets to the chorus, when you go, you're running and you're running and you're running away. All right. It changes a little. The bass line. It goes. So watch that pinky finger now. This is where the pinky finger takes charge. So one, two. See that? Again. Everything together. One more time. Sorry. Then you move to the next card, the C minor again. I already know to play this one. So here we go. At times it sounds a little bit different, so listen to this part. Hear that? Ta da ta da ta da. Pay attention to the pinky finger. The pinky finger is doing a lot of work. Huh? So you basically know all these already. You're just putting it together. All right. Now there are times when he plays. Tam ta dam ta dam ta dam ta. Tam ta dam ta dam, tam ta dam ta dam ta dam ta, tam ta dam ta dam, and tam ta dam ta dam. So listen to that. Here we go. Normal then. So here's a weird little change where it, um, the timing basically it changes faster. All right, so um, and it's the part where you go, you must have done something wrong. All right, so it goes like this. So it's the same two cards. It was moving faster. Are you playing? So it's thumb down, fingers up, thumb down, then switch to the card, same thing applies. My bad. So um, that's basically what it's playing right there. That's basically it for the song. You know what I mean? You just have to listen to it 
and um, put everything together. Remember again, guys, listen to the song. And remember to watch the entire video. Watch the entire video. All right, especially this one, you know, where it looks like it's probably all over the place, which it's really not. Um, you need to watch it so you can understand all the changes, you know, because there's an intro, then there's a lot of different parts. So <laughs> it's just one of those songs which you have to listen to. All right. It's just that. All right. So, yeah, that's it. I hope you guys were following. I hope you guys learned something, you know. Yeah.